Hello, this is Chris Menard. Today I'm going to discuss five tips in Microsoft Teams regarding conversations. Just so you know, conversations happen in a channel. Chats happen in chat. Chats are private. Conversations are not private. So that's actually tip number one. So I'm on Teams. I've got a product team. I have a finance team and then I have a website and videos team. Assume that this team has nine members. So if I go to webinars and I type in, so this is tip number two, if I want to discuss the webinars for May 2020, everyone in this team is going to get it. So I did a conversation. It even says new conversation at the bottom. So everyone has this. So another tip is if you're going to do a conversation and you specifically need someone to answer this question, are we doing any webinars in May 2020? I suggest you do an at mention because right now if there are seven people on the team and I'm one of them, six people have this who's to answer yes or no. So I would May 2020 at, this is for Christian to answer. So I did a at mention, I'll do it again at. Now I'm going to say, are we doing any webinars in May, in mid-May? I'm making this up. Christian just got a notify notification up in his activity feed, which is up in the top left corner. He's got an at symbol up there. So when he clicks on it, he can quickly click on that activity and jump to this question. I don't even know if he's around, so it doesn't matter. So use at mentions. Tip number three is follow the thread. There you go. So here's perfect. I'm glad he answered. So don't come down here. I said, are we doing any webinars in May in mid May? Christian wrote nothing planned. Don't come down here and make a new conversation. Conversations in channels are threaded. So I want to reply here. I'll look at the calendar today. And again, who is seeing this? I know it looks like just Christian and I are having a conversation, but everyone on the team is having it. Everyone on the team can see this. So another tip I have is when you're going to do a new conversation, before you start typing it, as my example right here, come down here to format and add a subject. That way it helps keep people using reply if you ask me. So I might call this May 2020 webinars and now I type the conversation below at Christian this is a test in real life I would not type this as a test send it off look at the difference this one has a subject line being used and it's just easier to follow so conversations are not private add a subject I just showed you that use at mention since everyone on the team can see it Another feature is you have meet now right here. If I click this, I can quickly meet with people in the team, which is website and video. So if I click meet now, this may not work since my camera is running and I'm recording, but I'm gonna hit meet now. Let's hope this works. And then who do you want to invite? It's going to show everyone in the team over here to the right, but I'm going to stop this meeting. And it even has a meeting icon here. But again, even if I only said I wanted to talk to Christian, someone else in the team, if they knew that meeting was happening, could join that meeting. That's just how it works. And the last tip number five is if I share a file, have you seen this computer? I'm making a new conversation, by the way. And again, if I want to reply and keep the thread going, I would hit reply. Just make sure you remember that. 
that's kind of a pet peeve of mine, people wanting to reply and making a new one. But I'm going to say, have you seen this computer? I'm going to drag an image over and drop it. And I'm going to send it. There you go. And it's a PDF file. The PDF files, Word, Excel, I don't care what type of file you drop. When you're in a channel and you're having a conversation, all the files end up in files at the top. So there's that PDF about Dell. It's the same one I just dropped right here. So there's nothing private in a team channel. Everyone in the team can see it. So just remember that. The one exception would be if you have a private channel, which I have a video about. If you look up in the top right, is private channels. But just remember, conversations are not private. And those are my five tips. Thank you. Have a great day. Take care. Oh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Now have a great day.